hello to uh, hello to he hello to you, mate. Who, who looks like you're fucking hating this? This is. Uh, <laughs> Do you, know, do you know, just one guy at the front just stood there looking at me going, I'm pretty sure I paid to see comedy, not fucking rag and bone, man. But this is... <laughs> it's all right. Uh, uh, so, hello to you, pal. What's, what's your name? Jason. Jason. Everyone say hi, Jason. Jason. It's nice to meet you, Jason. Jason, uh, where about from? Where are you representing? Hailwood. Pardon? Hailwood. Hailwood. <laughs> 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 fucking one person. They just went, ooh. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Is Jason okay? Are you okay? Do, what, what's it like, Aylwood, mate? It's all right. It's all right. Everyone else doesn't seem to think so, to be honest, mate. It sounds like Aylwood has got a bad trip advisor rating <laughs> just by the sound of people going, nah, no. Um, who are you out with, Jason? Who's this lovely lady? My wife. This is your wife? Oh, good stuff. Um, have, you, have, have you named her? <laughs> I mean, it's 2018. They can vote and everything, you know. What's her age? She, she, she had her own name before you even met her. That's, that's, that's how it works, mate. Yeah, we're not, in, we're not in Saudi Arabia now, you know what I mean? Yeah. And, uh, so what's her name? Sarah. Sarah. Cool, it's nice to meet you, Sarah. How long have Jason and Sarah been together for? 18 years, good for you two. Oh, and you're married and everything. Wait, it's so weird. Like, like did you know, like, like, what was the point when you knew that you were going to marry this woman? Did, did you know straight away? Straight away, oh, that's cute, isn't it? So you'd think that after seven months... <laughs> oh, I fucking love it, mate. He'd have put a ring on that shit by now, you lazy fucker. What are you doing in Hailwood, mate? What are you up to? What did you do today? It's my birthday today. It's your birthday? Oh, cool. Didn't ask, but all right. It's, uh, <laughs> It's all right, mate. How, uh, how old? Let me guess how old you are. Mm, I would say, like, I'll put you at 40s. You, you go with 40s? 40... Oh, 45. 46. 46. That was pretty fucking good. <laughs> so that is something... <laughs> we, we didn't even laugh. We all just, uh, 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 as a group, went, Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, very good. He's, he's, more, he's more, more than one string to his bow. Very nice. Um, what did you get for your birthday then, Jace? Here, an 18 pound ticket. <laughs> you lucky boy. Your real present comes tonight, doesn't it, Jason? You know what I'm saying, you know what I mean? Like, sweet, good for you. So, uh, so you, got, you got a ticket to this. Uh, what else did you get? Not a lot. Not a lot. Ah, what a bitch she is. <laughs> I thought she was lovely. After, you just didn't get anything, you got kids? Yeah. What did your kids get you? Not a lot. How, how old are your kids? Are your kids like quite young uh, and they're like six or whatever and they go, this is a macaroni picture of you I made and you have to pretend that it's not shit and then you go, oh, wow, wow. You know, like, what, what did they get you? You got a bottle of Baileys. I'm not being funny, mate, but a bottle of Baileys is the kind of present you get when Sharon from HR is leaving. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> We'll send a card round, we'll get her a bottle of Baileys. You know our Sharon, she loves the drink. Um, cool. What do you do day to day then, mate? What do you do? I'm a welder. You're a welder? Okay, what, what sort of stuff do you weld? <laughs> you do a lot of fabrication. It's a shame you can't fabricate any fucking answers. Jesus. <laughs> Christ almighty, it's like talking to somebody who's like been arrested or some shit. This is like 24 hours in police custody. You're just, the bloke's just there going, no comment. I fucking love that. You know, they get him in custody. And it's like, you've clearly raped and murdered that woman. And they're going, no comment. Do you know what I mean? Like trying to blag it out. No comment, no comment. Oh, mate, I fucking love trash telly. Do you watch, do you watch Can't Pay, We'll Take It Away? Oh, you watch that. You, oh, you missed that. She squeezed his arm as if to say, you like watching that as well. <laughs> you, you watch Can't Pay, We'll Take It Away. Oh, mate, I fucking love a bit of Can't Pay, We'll Take It Away. Have you got a favourite bailiff? <laughs> you have? Paul. Paul, Paul Bowhill and Stephen Pinner, yes. Paul Bowhill and Stephen Pinner combined. They have over 50 years of experience and they are... <laughs> 
They are firm but fair. Paul, Paul Bowhill is the little, he's the little brummy guy and he's got like a, he's got basically the shittest toupee I have ever seen in my life because God's repossessed his hair. Do you know what I mean? And he's got a little toupee and he just comes to us, you'll be giving us the outstanding balance of a million pounds today. And everyone just goes, who do you like? Stuart. Oh, uh, Stuart McCrack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like Elmore Victor. Uh, uh, I tell you who I don't like, though. I've got one guy who I don't like. I don't know his name, but I call him The Cube. And he's like a big fat... You know the big fat fucker? With... Oh, yeah, he's, he's a big fat fucker. And he's got like a shit, like, pedo goatee. <laughs> and he's got square glasses. And he just fucking comes in, like, belly bounces. The fucking door opens. <laughs> like, uh, yo, it's 47,000 pounds. <laughs> Is this, is this your hamster? Is this your hamster? Is this your hamster? Fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking love a bit of can't pay, we'll take it away. Oh, mate, my, oh my God. My, my girlfriend has got, uh, she's, she's got into watching a, a new reality show. I, I apologise for mentioning this because she'll want to watch it. It's called, oh my God. It's called Glow Up. <laughs> Do you like Glow Up? Do you like Glow Up? Of course you fucking would. I mean, it's basically what Glow Up is. is It's like, you know how they've got, like, Great British Bake Off and they've got, like, Great British fucking twat. Or, uh, you know, all that stuff. <laughs> Do you know, th this one is, like, the best British makeup artists. And it, y you heard... E look at every man then going, you fat bastard. <laughs> every fucking Champions League game, now I'm going to have to barter with fucking BBC iPlayer. <laughs> It's just, oh my God, because the thing is as well, is it is just women and gay men competing for fun. It's like, this week's there's a prosthetic challenge. <laughs> and Anna is getting stressed out because her primer isn't working properly. <laughs> this week, we've got a load of old ladies and we're going to have to contour their faces so they don't look like a ball bag. <laughs> it's just, fucking hell, man.